Middle Tennessee is getting a new music venue, but this time it's in neighboring Williamson County. Once completed, it will hold up to 5,000 people, more than the entire population of the city housing it. On News Channel 5's Jacqueline Newland visited the site this afternoon. Shows us how a small town is pre preserving its history while becoming a bigger part of Music City. Thompson Station only has one main road through its city center. And on that road, just a couple of businesses. It's very peaceful here. It's what surrounds this quaint town that makes it beautiful. I like to say we have 3,000 souls and 5,000 cows, and we kind of like that ratio. But soon the peacefulness of the country will make way every now and then for music and celebration. Just a few miles from the center of town, construction is underway for the Greystone Quarry Events Venue. Once completed, it will house a mountain lodge, two venue buildings, and an amphitheater that will seat up to 5,000 people. We want to be part of the landscape, and uh, I think everything that we're doing supports that. Rick and Nancy McEachern bought the property with the intentions to build an event venue, but once they saw the abandoned quarry in the back, their idea took a more musical turn. We could look beyond that and we saw something that was uh, really unique. Unique, yet just what this small town is ready for. I think it's a great opportunity to be able to have something here instead of driving all the way up to Nashville. And Karen Bethard is one of four stylists at the only salon in town. It's just peaceful here and love the people here. We used to visit here for about 20 years and then we decided to move here. They know the new venue will bring more people into the city their best kept secret will soon be found as the mayor attempts to preserve what's so special about Thompson Station with its inevitable growth. You can envision more retail and shopping, all that helps the tax base, creates jobs. Construction on this massive project will be done in two phases, with the first phase being done in about a year. Now, as far as the price tag, the landowners would only tell me they're investing a lot. In Thompson Station, I'm John Paul Newland, News Channel 5 HD. And the venue owner is planned to begin booking events in the next few months. They'll also live on the property once it's completed.